Next one is Blackout, and um, I'm fond of this one because it has that British sound <laughs> for me, you know, of all the bands that I, I grew up loving, New Order and like early Cure. And the bass playing and the performance on it is just magical. Mm. I mean, the bass solo coming out of the second chorus or out of the bridge is pretty fantastic, by the way. Got to give you some mm -hmm. kudos to that. Yeah. Oh, thank you. I remember hearing this song at the end of last year when we were in Europe. Oh, that's right. Yeah. At, uh, in London. Yeah. Blackout came from a jam that we did when our manager, Paul, called and asked us if we wanted to write a song for a vampire film. And he said, it's not a very good film, but if you want to take a stab at it, go ahead. And we were just sitting in, the, in my basement studio drinking some wine, as we usually do. And we just did this 20-minute jam, and it was really spare. Uh, Steve came up with the original bass line, and he was playing bass, and Duke played a baritone guitar, which had a kind of a weird detuning. And I just did a lot of programming. I went back and did the live drums later. And Cheryl did all, all this sort of uh, freeform vocals, and we just put it aside. We just thought, well, it's kind of ridiculous, and forgot about it, really. And about six months later, uh, we brought it into Billy's studio and we cut it down a little bit and then we started adding some more things and Cheryl wrote new lyrics and it's one of my favorite tracks on the record. Uh, I think it's going to be um, a mainstay of our show. I just have a feeling it's one of those songs that's going to be kind of an epic piece on stage. I mean, as, as I recall, I mean, we all remember things differently so you've got to forgive us. Like, as I recall, we were trying to capture Bella Lugosi's Dead by Bauhaus. And then by default, it actually does sound much more Cure inspired. But at least I was trying to do a Bauhaus kind of Bela Lugosi's dead, right? And we were laughing yeah. and well, thought it was Well, it was the funny. nature of the movie that we were writing for, that we were trying to write something dark. And we thought it was kind of funny. And yeah. then all of us separately kept coming back to that song saying, I know it's ridiculous, but I, there's something about this track I love. It was originally called The End. Because, That's right. Because, yeah. <laughs> because we thought for sure, we thought for sure it was going to be, if, if it was going to be in the movie, it would roll over the credits at the end of the movie, and then. then I think just... it wasn't even a line. Bring out your dead, right? Yes. Oh, yes. This yeah, is yeah, the yeah, end. Yeah. <laughs> Bring out your dead. This is the end. Uh, <laughs> and it made us laugh when we when we played it, and yeah. then Cheryl wrote all new lyrics to it, and the song went in it. So you can bring place. it back live. That's right. <laughs> yes. You know I will. You can vamp out. Sometimes when you work on something like that, just for fun, you don't even think about really what you're doing until you come back to it weeks later. It was like stumbling upon something like this little nugget that we had buried in the backyard, you know. Right, right. Digging it up again. That's great.